Titans gameplay, which um, not a lot to speak of there. But we're gonna start with Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if you saw it. this. Is uh, this is our old news at this point? This is the news that that inevitably came out. You know, like a couple weeks ago, like right after we did the last streamcast. Um, this is actually something that. Um, was reported a couple years ago in 2019, but this was like pre-pandemic. I think that Konami was going to start doing that. And if you don't know the current Yu-Gi-Oh scene, uh, tournament-wise, they just got back to doing in live, uh, in-person events. So that's probably why this news is is coming back. Uh, and I'm trying to find the article. I'll pop it up for you guys here. Oops, I just bumped. Where is the... This is the Google. You guys see the Google. Oh, oh my God. It's a news website with multiple ads everywhere. Um, uh, let's start from the top. An official update to their turn tournament policy was implemented, which specifically refers to the player's hygiene. It is the... It says, this is a new section requiring all persons attending a tournament to be clean and wear clean clothing. If you or your clothing is excessively dirty or bad smelling, you can be penalized. I, I, I don't know what the penalty awesome. is. I'll keep reading here. Uh, this rule has been placed hey, uh, for... They force you to take a shower. What's up? They, 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 they force you to take a shower. There. Yeah. Like, that, they well, that would... Yeah, technique. that was... For some of them, that is a penalty game. That's like a penalty game from the from season zero, where Yami like makes him take a shower for all eternity or something. <laughs> um, has it made an impact? Only those who have attended Yu-Gi-Oh tournaments can know for sure. Uh, this is from FragHero.com, by the way. Um, that would be that would actually be a good uh, rule. No, I don't know if I'd say rule change, but policy change that they would could do at other. I know people okay. have been complaining a lot over the years about Smash Bros. tournaments smelling like shit. The players there smell like shit. Really? I'm not mm -hmm. surprised. I'm not really surprised. But it, I understand, like, I do understand um, some people are like, oh, man. This is an interesting line, I guess, because I have heard from some people, like, you know, oh, my gosh, like, um, at cons and stuff, like, you know, beat don't be rude like don't you shouldn't like i wouldn't go up to that guy and be like tell him he smells like shit and i'm like you know what i'm sorry but maybe that's what some of these fucking people need because it's not just like oh i forgot to put deodorant on like i think most people are like oh you know that's all right like it'll smell like a little boe but some of these people i when i'm picturing the smell right now of a stinky person out of you -Oh, i've heard or stories of what people will actually do at, at card game tournaments. Like I think I think I've heard about some people who have actually like shit their pants to like throw people off because it's like a like a professional tournament so they and they're like in the top 8 so they'll actually like shit their pants so that it like really just uh starts to get in their head and they're just it really distracts them. People are willing to do stuff like that in order to win and that's uh really disgusting. <laughs> Sorry, I'm baffled. At okay, uh, I could see that, <laughs> um, but I don't know. For me personally, that wouldn't affect me. I'd be like, I'm still gonna fucking tribute this. I don't know. I get. I could see that. Um, and I've heard of. Um, I have heard stories, although I never knew if any of them were true, of NFL players doing the same thing. And I'm like, man. I don't know. I feel like they just throw my team off too. Like even if they kind of know what was so fucking weird. Um Yeah, uh Yeah, I would say if that was true. Oops. Uh, th there definitely should be some kind of penalty for what the fuck? Like Jesus Christ. Um I guess they're doing anything they can uh uh to win. I don't think there's been any kind of reports as to like how that rule is being implemented or anything, but it's, that's why it was our first story. I thought it was just kind of funny. It was just a lighthearted, like, in a way, lighthearted. Yeah. But I'm sure they're trying to, you know, it is disgusting. I do think, like I said, like, some of these people need to hear that, because, like, when I think of a stinky person at a con, like, I feel like I've smelled it before, and I'm like, it's not just, again, it's not like I forgot my deodorant, or I maybe forgot to brush no, my teeth today. People it's like, like this guy hasn't shit. showered in like a week, and it, and you can smell it from a couple tables down. Like, that is a thing, and I know exactly who those types of people are. And it's like, wash your... Well, wash your fucking everything. Come on. Like, 
there is there they, that's what some of these people like don't I'm like no I think they do need to hear like you smell like shit go take a fucking shower like Jesus Christ you know brush your fucking teeth for the rest of us because it because it does get to a hygiene point where it's like this person smells like they're carrying a fucking disease like am I gonna mm -hmm. catch something just from being in their area so I honestly like I know I've I, I some people they don't want you to be mean about certain I'm like no that is one thing that that as I've gotten older, like, I totally understand, like, saying to kids, no, but to an adult, be like, uh, just to be like, hey, man, you just, I just want you to know, like, you, s you smell awful. Like, like, yeah, because if yeah. they, if, look at it this way, if they didn't have that idea in mind to, like, clean themselves up for that tournament, if they don't get told that, they're not gonna, right. that's not something they're gonna go into the next tournament thinking that they gotta do. They're just gonna keep doing that until someone and, and you tells know them that that's not good. You know what? I don't think that if a person like were to go on Twitter and they were to say something like, "Oh, I got kicked out of a Yu-Gi-Oh tournament. Uh, they told me I came up to me and I stink." Blah 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 blah. I actually don't think that person would get a lot of support. They'd probably be like, "Yeah, go take a shower." I, I actually think even like the the hardest of hardcore like uh, like softies on Twitter would be like, "Yeah." Like we're tired of it too, because I've I've heard a lot of people say that they're sick of that shit with when it comes to, uh, um, like cons and stuff. But anyway, yeah. anyway, uh, how do you picture a smell? Well, I guess I just mean like I I know, you know what that kind of person looks like and smells like, and I've been around these some of these dorks, you know that, you know these fucking doofuses. Um, anyways, 